offset duplicate animation loop so they start at different frames. In Blender 2.79, set the end frame to your desired loop length. Ours will be 24 frames. Numpad 7 and 5 for top orthographic view. Shift A to add plane axes. G, X, negative 3, enter to move it away from the cube. Right click the cube, then shift right click the plane axes. Control P to parent, so we can animate the cube on local axes later on. Right click the cube, go to frame 0, and press I over the viewport to keyframe. Do the same at the middle and end frames of your loop. Go back to the middle frame and press G, Y, negative 4, enter, and I over the viewport to keyframe a simple animation. Go to the NLA editor. Make the animation we just created into a new strip by pressing this double down arrow button. Press N to open the sidebar. Make our animation repeat an arbitrarily high number of times, so it will still play an entire loop even after we offset later on. Go to 3D view and right click the cube. Then shift right click the plane axis. Shift D, G, X, 4 and enter to duplicate some distance away from the original. Go back to the NLA editor. Right click the second strip and press G, negative 12 and enter to offset the desired number of frames. Go back yet again to 3D view and alt drag the viewport to see it from a better angle. Press play. Whee! And this basic principle can theoretically be used for things like flowing grass, or pistons, or a waving crowd. Essentially, situations where you need to duplicate and offset an animation loop. Why didn't you just use the dope sheet? What did you just call me, bub?